Leah? Leah, you up? Oh, she's sleeping. Leroy, she's sleeping! Mom. I tried sitting it earlier, but you know, I want to let you sleep in. Didn't want to wake you, so. Right. Wait, hold up, hold up. Leroy, come wish me happy birthday. Happy birthday. Thanks, Dad. All right, uh, bye. So, Wait, you're leaving? Where are you going? Just out for brunch with Didi, so. Didi, I haven't seen her in such a long time. Yeah. She just invited her over. That's yeah, okay. All right, I'm going to go now, all right? Wait, Leroy. You know you're not working right now, so you better save your money. I'm just Ma, a woman. Ma, it's okay. I got a job. It's fine. You know. You got a job? Oh, yeah. my God. I, oh, okay. Praise God. Yes. Praise God. All right. I, I gotta go. See ya. So where are you going? Are you going downtown? Ma, please. Well. I didn't. Have a good day, Leah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. 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 Ma. Can I please borrow your Metro card? Oh my goodness. Thank you. Well, that's over. Remember Alex, Tinder Bay? Well, apparently me not being able to fuck at my place is a deal breaker, so Tinder Bay is tired of being Airbnb Bay. Girl, there's plenty of fish in the sea. Mm. Fish that don't mind those it's just, ugh, I'm so over not having my own place, Didi. Like, I know it could be worse. I know people are homeless, but I cannot stand living with Deborah and Leroy. Aw, Debbie and Roy Roy. Uh, you go live with them. Can you believe my mom was grilling me before I left the house? Like, I'm 28. Like, it's pathetic. Girl, my mother does that to me all the time, and I don't even live with them. It's because they care. You see, that's what I should be saying. I'm at an age where I'm supposed to start liking my parents. Your late 20s are for recognizing your parents are just adorable old people who love you. <laughs> okay. So you need to move out. Mm -hmm. Big deal. This year is going to be your year, Leah. I know LA was. Nah, nah, that, that's what we're not gonna do. We don't talk about LA. We know this. We don't talk. Okay. So let's just say mm -hmm. you took a big risk mm -hmm. in a city mm -hmm. that will not go unnamed. Okay. But now you have a fresh start. I, I guess. I mean, speaking of fresh starts, I do have a new job. <laughs> mm -hmm. That video producer shit? No, they didn't want my black ass. But they decided to pursue other candidates. But um, I do have a receptionist gig at some law firm. So there's that. Well, congrats. Goodbye. I'm dead ass. Mm. You know you're going to be making money, right? Mm. Which means you're going to be able to afford an apartment, right? Mm. Which means that you're going to be having sex with some online admirers. Oh my like gosh. a real grown up. Do you do? And you'll be able to love your parents again. This is great news. I say, okay, I get that, right? But like, I'm just so tired of waiting for my moment, you know? Like, when I was 21, I had all these goals for myself. I was supposed to leave the Bronx for good, move to the West Coast, debut at Sundance by 24, be on a 30 on a 30 list by 25. By 26, I'd get my master's as like this up and coming celebrity filmmaker who's like so humble for getting higher education despite her massive success. And 27, brunch with Oprah. And today on my 28th birthday, I should be on a yacht going over scripts with Ava DuVernay. Bitch, you didn't even know who Ava DuVernay was when you was 21. You couldn't wait too much pressure on yourself. Just let life happen. I'm almost 30, ZD. What do I have to show for myself? What, like? A mediocre career, a crappy job, no love life, an admin resume. I wish I could drag people the way you drag yourself. Mm. Okay, so you still haven't figured it out yet. No. Who has? We all lost the fuck. You had some setbacks, 
It's okay. Not millennial superstar. Who cares? Now, I see. I don't know if you've noticed this, Dee Dee, but the way media is going right now is heading straight towards Black Girl Magicville, and I'm afraid I'm gonna miss that train. Leah. No, you know black is a come and go trend. I don't want to have to wait another 20 years to be put on. Everywhere I go, I see a magical, beautiful black girl who's like living her best life, making movies, making shows, popping on the gram. She's got a million followers. Like see, This is why I don't do that Twitter and Facebook shit. There she goes. Because y'all just get caught up in this digital reality. Oh, and goodness. I don't know why you, out of all people, the way your anxiety is set up, mm. do this to yourself. I'm a masochist.